In this video, I'm going to show you how to access a list of all the emails you have sent from a D2L course class list, as well as showing you how to make sure that D2L is sending a copy of any emails you send from a course class list to your regular email inbox. First, let's find that sent email folder. To begin, click on this mail icon here in the upper right portion of your screen. It doesn't matter whether you are in a course or on the home page, this icon should still be there. Then click the email link. This is a screen where you can send an email to someone if you wish, but what we're looking for is this sent mail button here on the right hand side of the screen. This is going to pull up a list of all the emails you have sent from the system. If you click on the subject of an email, it will show you who the email was sent to, when it was sent, and what the message was. It's important to note that it will not tell you what course the email was sent from, so you may want to get in the habit of including your course name or ID in the email subject if that's something that's important for you to track. You can click this tiny little sent mail breadcrumb link to get back to the sent mail list, or you can use your back button or just click a different navbar link to leave this screen. Next, let's make sure your settings are configured so that emails you send go into that repository we were just looking at, as well as making sure that you get copies of all the emails you've sent in your regular email inbox. To check this, click on your name at the top of the screen, and then select Account Settings. If you've never looked at the settings on this screen, it's definitely worth some time to look through them, but for now, we're going to go straight to the Email tab, which is the third tab. On this tab, you'll want to make sure both of the two checkbox options are selected. This will ensure that your messages do go to that sent folder we just looked at, and it will also make sure that you are receiving a copy of all the emails you send in your regular email inbox. If you've made any changes to those settings or to anything else on this account settings page, you're going to hit save and close, and that will take you back to the home page.